Congratulations to Frida Hand's daughter winning the gold in the women's slalom. Good job, Frida. Congratulations for your hard work and getting there and doing so well. And also to all the uh, all the athletes for your best efforts. You're the top of the class, best of the best. And uh, we also we're here in California rooting for all the athletes, especially Americans, but all the athletes we care about and pray for and uh, also send the invitation to accept Christ if you don't know Jesus as your Savior. So if you're ready we invite you to say I'm sorry Jesus for my sins thank you for dying to save me I welcome you to my heart and commit my life to you because we're all sinners and Christ is the only way to eternal life and grace forgiveness here in this life right here and now so if you can say that then I baptize you in the name of the Father Son and Holy Spirit and you are now a Christian by virtue of your faith and conviction not by this not by the baptism which is a symbol of seal of ceremony it's your faith that makes you Christian and keeps you Christian now assured of eternal life, heaven, when you die, as long as you keep that faith, keep growing in Christ, keep telling others the good news. So, it's a great day to be a Christian. Every day is. But, uh, Frida, if you make that decision, that's gold on top of gold. That's eternal gold. Or if you're already a Christian, some of you, and Frida, maybe you are. And I just want to encourage you to keep telling others the good news about Jesus Christ our Savior right there at the Olympics and everywhere else. So read more a little bit in the box below. And if you have any questions or for a free Bible, Frida or anybody, message me here on YouTube. And I'll be praying for you. Lord, we pray for all the uh, Winter Olympic athletes and for Frida and for anybody else, the fans, the uh Employees there, organizers, everybody in the whole world for that matter. Be with them, guide them, lead them. Let them know you and trust you and believe in you. Fill them with the Holy Spirit so they can love you with all their heart, mind, strength, and soul and tell others the good news. Pray in the name of the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Amen.